them in a day in May. Hey everyone, happy Sunday. Uh, I'm a little under the weather today, so I'm just gonna kind of chill here and talk to you guys. Uh, if my parents were here, they'd probably tell me to rest, take it easy, drink lots of water. Water, I mean, I have tea. Dihydrogen monoxide, H2O. This is the very first compound, how exciting, uh, on element a day in May. Um, and that's because it's probably one of the best and most important compounds on this planet, and possibly others. Do -do 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 -do. Uh, we use water to drink. We wash our bodies with it, brush our teeth, make our coffee, wash the dishes, flush toilets, uh, entertain us and our cats. Uh, water means life. Our bodies are around 60 to 70 percent water, and some organs like our lungs are actually 83 percent water. Water helps form saliva, which aids uh, with your digestion. It flushes body waste through urine. It regulates your body temperature through sweating and respiration. It actually acts as a shock absorber uh, with your brain, for your brain and spinal cord. It helps lubricate your joints, helps deliver oxygen through the body, and much more. Um, but water, it's usually not just H2O. The water we drink has a lot of natural salts and minerals, so it's not just dihydrogen monoxide. Water that contains minerals like calcium and magnesium is referred to as hard water, and people generally prefer to drink this type of water uh, for the taste, that is water with minerals, because it just tastes a little bit better than pure, pure water. Um, although there is a limit, too hard, and of course it's not gonna taste too good. Um, and then sometimes there's elements like chlorine in there that a lot of people don't like. It doesn't really have a great taste to it or smell. Um, soft water contains just sodium ions that can sometimes have a little salty taste, but is preferred for cleaning. Uh, and then water is also uh, purified through distillation and deionization. You've probably heard of distilled water and deionized water. Uh, distilled water is generally okay to drink. It's really great for irons and steamers because it doesn't have the buildup. Deionized water, not okay to drink. It's pretty caustic, it acts as a solvent. I've used it in labs to clean things. I, I wouldn't recommend drinking it. I prefer my H2O uh, with quite a bit more than just dihydrogen monoxide. Um, and then also just drinking a lot of super purified water, it can actually affect the balance of salt and water in your cells. Um, and then on that note, too much water consumption, that's a thing. So stay away from water drinking competitions. Definitely drink plenty of water, but you know, if you're gonna drink a lot of it, it's good to balance it out in the form of electrolytes. I just spilled tea all over myself. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I hope you're going to enjoy Compound Week on Element A Day in May. And uh, let us know in the comment section below, by us, I just, I mean me, um, what is your favorite experience with dihydrogen monoxide? Um, or what is your favorite compound? Maybe we're gonna cover it this week. And uh, please subscribe if you're not subscribed and we'll see you soon, bye.